going to be a back to school haul from Kalispell. I went over the weekend and we went camping and I did some shopping obviously. But in about a week we are going to um, Spokane. So I'm doing way more shopping there just because there's more stores and the malls and everything. This is bigger and yeah. So. But this is just a little bit of stuff. It's not too much. Just a couple clothing pieces here and there. Um, so I, I thought I'd show you anyways. I don't want to wait and combine both hauls or both trips into one just because I'm going to forget stuff from this trip. And it's just, I don't want to do that. So let's just get into it and we'll start with clothes. How about that? So first thing I got was from Route 21. And these are just some light wash jeans. I recently bought, you guys, if you watch my recent haul, it's from Calvin Klein. I got some dark wash jeans. And I decided to get some light wash because the only light wash I have is jeggings. Uh, they're retarded. They're from Old Navy and they are actually so frustrating to wear because with Uggs, you wear them and they scrunch up. With like anything, they just scrunch up so bad. And they're just too big for me, I guess. And Anyways, these fit me really well, and these are Low Rise Zero Slash One Regular, and they were $19.99, so, I don't know, 20 bucks for jeans, that's pretty good, don't you think? Um, and they're a little bit long, so I'll just cuff them, or I can put them onto my heel if I'm wearing Uggs or something, so no problem. Um, this is from Ross, this is so cute. When I first saw it, uh... I don't know, it just looked like a piece of cloth to me. I don't know, I tried it on, it looked very flattering, so I decided to get it. It's this grey dress, and it's got some lace, I guess, cheetah print, which is really cool. I've never seen anything like it, I guess. And it's got kind of cinching in the middle, so it defines the waist and makes it flattering, which is what makes it flattering. If this wasn't here, it looked like a piece of cloth. Uh, it was... $8.99, like what? And compared at $29, which is such a good deal. Next item is from Ross, and I thought it was beautiful. I think I mentioned the dress up from Ross as well, but it's super cute. I don't know. It's a cheetah print tank top, and it's got a cute zipper in the back, and the back is not sequined, unlike the front. This was $12.88. Now this one, I got from Walmart. Okay, looks like this. It's by this brand. I don't know. OP. That's what it is. Okay, I thought that's what it was, but I wasn't sure. Anyways, I saw it. I liked it. Um, I don't know. Like Walmart here is embarrassing. George is crap, and I hate it. And if I lived in the states, and if I had faded glory, well, I think we have this here, but it's just like bathing suits. But if I had faded glory here. Walmart would be like my Forever 21 one. I don't know, I like it. I think it's cute. It's got like a, I don't know, thingy in the back here. The next thing looks like this. It kind of looks like a denim vest. I don't know, I liked it. Um, it's this light wash blue with a black cheater leopard whatever print with, I don't know, these looking pearly thingies as buttons. Obviously not pearls. Yeah. But it's just a shirt with a collar. I don't know. It would, I think it would look cute. And this was $16.99 on sale. Alright, next thing is probably my favorite. Other than the dress. I really like the dress. But anyways, it looks like this. It's from Room 21 as well. And I thought it was beautiful. Look, look at it. Isn't it gorgeous? I don't know. It's this um, kind of like a purpley pink color with this lace. And it's not the, well you probably would have to wear the front or something underneath it, but it's not completely lace so there is a little bit of this pink stuff on the inside. This was $16.99 as well. That's all the clothes. Gum to me. Um, then I have some, let's do bracelets and then we'll do all the rest of the crap. So I got some bracelets because I've been kind of into arm candy again. I got this one, which looks like this. This one is from Route 21 as well. It looks like this. It's a sideways cross uh, with, it's just silver, which is really pretty. I don't know. I know these things can be really expensive, and when I saw this, it was pretty cheap, so I just got it. 
next one is from Target. This one is, I think, better quality because the string is a little bit thicker and a little bit tougher. It's a cute bow, and it's gold. Looks like this. The next one looks like this. I don't want to take it off because it's that little clip closure, which is frustrating to get on. But it looks like this. It's just two little wings. I guess I thought it was a mustache when I first saw it, but it's not. It's just these little wings. And then the last one on my hand, on my wrist currently, is this one. And it's cute. It's got this little pull thing, which I like. It's very easy to close and it's not very... It's safe. And so it looks like this. It's light blue and it's got little fake diamond rhinestone thingies. Which is cute. So... Yeah, that's kind of my arm candy for now, and then I have my charm bracelet, so I'll show you that in just a sec. I was thinking of doing a giveaway with one of these, let me know anything below, but it's just a charm bracelet, I have a couple charms on here, which is really cute, I like this one because it's sparkly, but yeah, I don't know if you can see that, it's pretty. Anyways, I got more, oh, it was really cool. um, I got two more from Route 21. All of them except for the bow one was from Route 21. Um, I don't know what it is. I have no idea. It kind of looks like corn, maybe? Or french fries? So, I don't really know what it is. I don't know. At first I thought it was a flip-flop, maybe, if you look at it this way. I don't know. But again, it's got that closure, which I personally really like. And then I've got this one, which is just like a stretchy blue thing. With a couple of the silver little thingies. It's just a bead one. And then I got two more from Target. I got a wrap one, which I was really excited about because I couldn't... It's not that I couldn't find one, it's just I wasn't really looking for one. And it never crossed my mind, but I really like it. I think it's really pretty. It's got... It's pink, and it's got, like, rhinestones, but then in the back here it's got a uh, gold closure. It's orange with these... They don't even look like rhinestones. I don't know what these are. They're just weird little balls that are metallic. I don't know. Again, with the little closure that I like. Um, that's all the bracelets I got, which I think is kind of a lot for one trip. I don't know. Maybe kind of, sort of, I don't know. Then I have two makeup products, which is not typical for me. I don't usually buy too much makeup just because I have so much that I just don't use. Or, I mean, I have a specific routine that can contains specific products. So I got two things from e.l.f. I went to Walmart with my mom and they have e.l.f. at Walmart. Anyway, so I got two products. This one is pretty popular. It's the e.l.f. 310, 3101 Pink Lemonade All Over Color Stick. And it's just like a little... I was going to use it today, but then I was like, no. I need to film my haul. So it looks like this. And, I don't know, it's just for, you can use it for lips, eyes, or, and or face, so. I think I'm just going to use it maybe as a blush, maybe a little bit for, like, the colors. And then I got a Zid Zapper, which is interesting. Um, I haven't tried it, obviously, because it's packaged. But it does contain salicylic acid, which I think my skin is immune to that. I just, I don't know. But, I mean, if it doesn't work, I'll, I'll give it to my brother or whatever, you know, it was a dollar, so it's not that, that big of a deal, and it's just, I think, something worth trying, because if you are struggling with acne, maybe this could work for you. And then, next thing I am in love with, it's an owl phone case! I've recently developed an obsession with owls, so I'm going to me, but, um, thanks to my friend Abby, she's, she's got a and such from the owls as well, and she got me hooked. Anyways, it's a pink owl. I think it's friggin' adorable. Okay, um, next I got, this is from Ross, and I got seven nail polishes. These are really cute. Um, I really like them, I like the colors and stuff. There was more that they had, but I really like the glitter polishes, which is kind of why I got this one, because I love the glitter and stuff. And they're huge, like, can we just take a moment to look at how huge these things are? They're big. So, so yeah, it's really cute. And the last thing I think I got was, or were, I guess, these are my life, okay? These are adorable, and I think anyone would agree, because they're adorable. I hope it's not, like, glaring right now, 
but it might be. Oh well. Things are cute. They're cute. They're just black glasses with a little bow. These are from Blue 21. You guys actually have a chance to win one of these. So, um, soon from now I'm going to be doing a question and answer video. All you must do is go in the comments and leave me as many questions as you would like. One question equals one entry. So the more questions you leave, the better chance you have of winning. Um, you cannot copy paste. You have to come up with a new question every time you do the comments. So, and I'll be doing that video very soon and answering all your questions. Anything you wanted to ask me, here's your chance. And obviously you won't be receiving these, because these are mine, but identical ones. Uh, yeah. And I will contact her, cont contact her, contact first place winner for whichever one they want. If they want glasses, I'll send them that. If they want nail polishes, send them that. And then the second place winner will be receiving whichever one is left. Uh, yeah. So hopefully you guys liked this video. Please enter the giveaway. Uh, oh, you must be subscribed, obviously. Did I like leave that out? Like the video. Subscribe to my channel, obviously. Obviously. If you don't subscribe to my channel, then that's a fail. I'll be checking. By the way. So yeah, subscribe to my channel, like the video, and leave a comment for a question. Uh, yeah. Giveaway will end whenever I decide. And yeah. Uh, I will not be putting up a video telling you guys who the winner is because I get, I did, I do this every time I do a giveaway, I just tongue tied all day. Every time I do a video or a giveaway, I don't follow up with another video with the winner. I just message them and I'm like, hey, I need your address. Yeah, so that's what it's going to be this time. So if you don't get an inbox, then chances are you're not the winner. But I don't know how long this video is gonna last, so whatever. It's probably really glaring pretty bad. It's probably annoying, guys. It's probably gonna annoy me so bad when I'm editing. Anyways, I'm gonna take them off just in case. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, happy entering. Good luck on winning. Alright, I'm gonna go now. Because this is getting way too long. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I am looking for a new camera. If that's. Uh, bother to some of you because it definitely is for me because I know the volume is like screwed up and everything else is just so and you know what it does it turns off randomly so I'll be filming it turns off I have to start over there's probably like a hundred clips from one video it's ridiculous okay I think I've bored you guys enough I will talk to you in my next video bye I'm like, like what? Hi. Oh my god, Kate, I'm gonna freaking shoot them all. And it says real 3D. Because I was so cool and I popped the lenses out. Holla. No, okay, this is like ridiculous. Don't ever do that, please.